isotope of the rarest element on Earth has been discovered. Research in which silver atoms were bombarded with a beam of strontium-84 led to the formation of a hitherto unknown atomic nucleus. Astatine 190 the nucleus consists of 85 protons and 105 neutrons and is the lightest astatine isotope discovered to date. Sometimes important discoveries are made by accident. This was also the case this time. When a new isotope of one of the elements was obtained by conducting research in a completely different direction. It is astatine which is extremely unstable under natural conditions. Isotopes are different forms of the same element that contain the same number of protons, but differ in the number of neutrons. Many elements have several, and some, even several dozen isotopes. In nature, elements are usually found as their mixtures. As for astatine, the isotope of which has just been discovered, it is a radioactive, extremely rapidly decaying and rare element. So rare that, according to estimates, there is less than one gram of it in the entire Earth's crust. The description and results of the research in which the new astatine isotope was obtained were published in the journal Physical Review C. The research was conducted by Henna Kokkonen, a student at the Finnish University of Jyväskylä, and was part of her master's thesis. During her research, she bombarded silver atoms with a beam of strontium-84. Then she observed the products formed in the process of decay. In this case, radioactive alpha decay occurs during which the atomic nucleus loses a group of two protons and two neutrons, called an alpha particle. This process continues until the given nucleus 
stabilizes. And that's when she stumbled upon something she didn't expect. An isotope that had never been obtained before. It is astatine 190, containing 85 protons and 105 neutrons. Which at the same time set a new record as the lightest so far known isotope of this element. The previous record holder in this respect was astatine 192. Astatine is extremely radioactive and very unstable. In natural conditions, it is practically only a stage, because it becomes a product of the decomposition of heavier elements and then disintegrates itself into the next, even lighter one. Unfortunately, we will not find any stable form of it. The best in this respect is astatine 210 whose half-life is, as much as, 8 hours. And compared to other isotopes, it is a sensation. Because in the case of the vast majority of them it is a maximum of a few seconds. Compared to other members of its isotopic family, astatine 190 is by no means an exception. Its half-life is only one millisecond. Given the above information, it should come as no surprise that astatine is an extremely rare element. Some sources say that each time on our planet its total weight does not exceed one gram. Others that it is a maximum of a tablespoon, several dozen grams. Therefore, the Guinness Book of Records recognized astatine as the rarest element on Earth. As we already know, it decomposes quite quickly, which usually ends when it reaches stable forms in the form of bismuth or radon. This also means that we know very little about its physical properties. 
scientists hope that further research on both this isotope and astatine itself will also contribute to a better understanding of the very process of radioactive alpha decay. Although scientists know that such a decay results in the ejection of an alpha particle, after years of research, they still do not know the exact details of how this process takes place.